The staff members at the Preston Library were hard at work on January 16th, preparing for the opening reception of the Pest Exhibition. This exhibition highlights the creative displays designed by Amy Swartz, a visual artist based in Toronto. They consist of the bodies of insects combined with toy army heads, reenacting human interactions that have taken place throughout the course of history. I first discovered um, a dragonfly on my windowsill. Um, my mother had died and I was pregnant. And that, that insect was so still and beautiful. And it, kind of, it made me think of that life and death duality. Viewers had the chance of listening to Swartz's story, as well as having photos taken with her. Many people of all ages were keenly interested in what she had created and were inspired by her outlook on life. I started to collect insects. I don't really know why, but I can store them in all these little containers. And then I, um, and I didn't know to put them in the freezer at the time, so they stunk, right? Like you put them in these containers and then you open them up and it's like, whoa. And uh, then I had children and they started to have toys. And actually Andrew's mom brought over this bag this big bag of toy soldiers that he had when he was a kid. And he had very carefully painted them. They were beautiful. And some of the heads had fallen off and the arms. And one day I attached um, one of these beautiful heads that Andrew had made to a moth. And I called it Mothman. Amy Swartz's pest exhibition runs right through until February the 24th. For Spoke Online, I'm Wesley Butler.